So, yeah, if you follow Gervonta Tank Davis on uh, social media, specifically on uh, Instagram, he uh, recently posted something interesting. Um, I'm actually surprised he doesn't really post much. I guess he deleted uh, previous posts be from you know from before. Um, Gervonta Davis does have the tendency to delete things right after posting them, and I'm actually surprised that uh, the post I'm about to talk about right now uh, he he kept it. It's been 30 minutes since he posted it at the time I'm making this video, and uh, it's still here. It's still up. Um, yeah, his most recent post, which is this one, it's uh, multiple pictures with the. Uh, caption that reads keeping my composure I'm on chill I can't panic and uh, and yeah it's just pictures of him uh, whatever this is uh, of a guy talking to his aunt or it's like a meme I guess and another picture of him and this right here it's specifically this one talking about this one specifically it's one with Floyd um, it's a photo of Floyd when he vis visited Russia uh, Floyd was dressed in, uh, he was dressed like this, but he had pants on. He didn't have, you know, short shorts on. This is obviously, uh, Photoshop, uh, to make it look like he had no pants on. But in, in the real photo, he had pants on, but, you know, he was still wearing that boot, that boots and that, uh, that jacket. And it was in Russia. It was from sort of a few years ago. I think when Floyd retired from after the sport, when he was on like pretty much on tour, around the world and I think he visited some gym over in Russia and um, and yeah and you know this photo has been around for quite some time now but for Gervonta to post it, it it does create some conversations of you know what's going on again between Floyd and Gervonta I mean lately the past year or so it had, things haven't really been looking good when it comes to the relationship between Gervonta and uh, Floyd uh, Gervonta um, Seems like he he doesn't like to be associated with Floyd anymore. That's what it looks like. Uh, <laughs> and he's making it clear by posting this photo up, making fun of Floyd. Um, to me, it seems like he's no, definitely no longer with Mayweather Promotions. Uh, his last fight against Raleigh was his last fight, at least on contract. He's still with Al Heyman for sure. But with Floyd, it looks like he's no longer with Floyd. And uh, who knows what will happen next. I mean, Gervonta right now, uh, he's facing some uh, legal problems. Uh, he's facing assault charges, I believe, in in Florida. And he's uh, also facing um, hit and run charges, uh, I believe, here in Maryland. Um, you know, Gervonta is my boy, man. I mean, he's from Maryland, support my fellow Marylanders. But if you're going to be committing shit like that, you deserve to get punished in some type of formal way whether it's compensation or jail time or what have you but it looks like the uh, one of the victims is definitely uh pushing forward to to go to trial and uh, I, I won't be surprised if uh, Gervonta face some jail time after December I think it's going to be in mid December the second second week uh of December I think uh he'll be having some trials so anyway Gervonta uh also posted this photo of some shoes um, and this, uh, some Uno, you know, happiness is temporary, <laughs> uh, you know, with the cards there, if you play Uno, um, I guess some more pictures of material stuff and something about Fort Quarters personal. I don't, I don't know what message he's trying to send here, but, uh, maybe he knows he's going to jail. Who knows? I don't know. And he's making his message clear of what every message he's trying to send out here um but but yeah this one was definitely the the biggest conversation for the most recent post so we'll see what happens to uh gervonta um i'll keep you guys updated let me know your thoughts in the comments thanks for listening and watching and like always have a great day all right thanks